how do you define a leader? What makes a person great enough to lead others? Medal of Honor recipient Major General Patrick Brady spoke at the National School Board Association's President Retreat about exactly what it takes. There's no such thing, I don't believe, as a, a leader who isn't also a very uh, good person, a spiritual person, a person who has discipline in all the elements of his humanity. Patrick Brady went to O'Day High School in Seattle, Washington, where he was taught by the Christian Brothers of Ireland. There he learned the leadership skills that he says eventually led him to be one of only 79 recipients of the Distinguished Medal of Honor. So they combined for me the three elements of human nature, you know, your physical, your intellectual, and your spiritual, and it was all in those folks that taught us. Leadership qualities can begin to show themselves at a very early age, but it takes hard work, dedication, and a pursuit of those qualities to truly be a leader. And once you realize that courage is the key to success in life, and you can have all the courage you want, that destroys all the excuses you have to be mediocre or to fail. Major General Brady is a man who has seen many generations change the world, but he says it's the simplest of values that are the most important to remember. You can be very, very successful in a material way, but you, you may not be a happy person. Why not, at the end of the day, be further ahead than you were at the beginning of the day? For Wake Up Germantown, I'm Justin Rowland.